start muna siguro tayo sa any testimony. Uh, gusto natin pasalamatan ng Diyos. Anyone can start any testimony? Uh, ako, ako, Pastor. Sige po. Uh, kasi si David, anak ko sa Philippines, kasi di ba, uh, deaf and deaf and deaf. He found a church sa may Shangri-La just last week favorite church na dedicated to the deaf and mute. So, sinag- ah, yeah, isinag niya kay Stephen so starting last Saturday, nakakapag-service na siya. Kasi pag uh-huh. nagsiservice tayo, hindi naman niya nakukuha wala sa nangyindihan. Yeah. At least yun, may nagsa sign language. So, I I made sure na pinatap si service. Okay. So, ano yun? Sabado night yun? Ngayon? Ah, uh, Sunday night. Sunday after morning, afternoon dito sa atin. Ah, okay. Okay, okay. Ano ang pangalan ng church? Faith. Faith. Faith church yata yun. Faith. Sa may Shangri-La. Okay. Yeah, tapos uh, binivisit nila si David every once a week yata for Bible study. Online din. So, okay. kinokonnect siya rin si Stephen. At least nagkakaroon siya ng church. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. Kasi hindi natin makikir sa kanya eh. I know. Actually, matagal ko nang pinag-iisipan nga kung paano i-disciple si Stephen. <laughs> oh, yun. But uh, I make sure every morning pag gising niya, nagbabasa siya ng Bible. Although hindi niya, siyempre, wala naman explanation. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Tapos pagka tulog namin sa gabi, bago matulog, sabay namin binabasa yung time 9 to 1. Mm-hmm. Kaya naiintindihan niya. Yeah. I think sa ano sa Shepherd Church po meron po sila na sign sign Shepherd Church. Meron silang sign na language. Ah yeah, yeah. I think so. Di ko alam. Um, nag-online ka. Maraming nags- may mga sign language sila. Mag-research ka ng Deaf and New Church. Marami dito. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Kung nga pala no, yun pala yung ano ano. Media. Anybody else? Uh, so mag testify, testimony. Eh, yeah, apat lang naman tayo. <laughs> 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 Ay, nako. Ayun ang ano yun, ang ministry. Magkawaan <laughs> eh. Puro ministry. Teka, may rating yung charger. Yeah. yeah. I was thinking na ano eh na na ilipat na seven gawin gawin siyang ano Zoom prayer breakfast. Titing na natin kung meron kung merong available. Good morning. Good morning naman. Ah, okay, we were looking at ano eh ano yung pinaka possible na ano eh, na, na oras eh. Kasi ang mga seven o'clock tulad sa akin. Pagdating ko luto ng luto. Yeah. Kain. Nagrarap na ako. Kasi ang Bible study niya, seven. Hinihingal na ako. Pa, ano, pa, ma, mamadali. Yeah. Ako nagtatrabaho. Eh, di tulad ng iba. Nag-quarantine sa bahay lang. Yeah. So, hindi. I have to really work. And minsan, muwi ako mga six na. At saka pa magluluto. Seven ka agad. Sabi ko, ang hirap naman ang oras mo lagi. Ako naghahabon. <laughs> Okay, okay na yung Bible study. Ang problema, pag Sabado, 7 o'clock, napapansin ko, mukhang madaming gimmick yung mga tao na ginagawa, umaaten ng uh, saan-saan, party, whatever. Eh, pero supposedly, nasa bahay ngayon. Pero yun na eh, kung kung hirap ngayon, lalo na pagbalik sa normal. Eh. So, I think uh, we need to adjust yung time. Lalo na ang klase yung mga bata, may hirap ang yeah. online. Matagal pa naman ang classes eh. I think, uh, ang, ang sinet ng LAUSD is August eh. Hindi reopen sila. Philippines Philippi- din yata, Pastor, i-adjust nila ng August. Opo, i-adjust nga nila. So, Bakit daw? Dahil sa ulan? Hindi, ah, sa COVID. Sa COVID. Dahil sa COVID. Oh, Di ba na-adjust na sila that even without COVID? Opo. Uh, Pero binalik uh, uli ata nila sa June eh. Dati in-adjust uh, nila yun, alam ko eh. Pero binalik nila sa June. Hi JP, hi Joanne. 
Hello, Pastor. Good evening. Yan yeah, na uh, Naku, nasa ano pa kayo? Nasa lalabas pa. <laughs> sa, sa, Hi, sorry, Pastor. Eh, sorry, sorry. Dinner na eh. Gaiking kayo? Sa so, naghang. Hi, Sister Lelen. Hi, good evening. Good evening. Major Lane. So, I'd like to meet si Sister Joan and si Brother JP. Hello. Hi, hi sa kanila. So, hi. Hello. Any testimony, Sister Lennon? Traffic. Traffic. Na traffic na? Na traffic po, galing ano, trabaho. Ah, okay. Nako, yan na. Balik na ang traffic. Welcome back. <laughs> Any testimony, Sister Joan? Uh, uh, po, safety and thank you, Lord, that uh, uh, we were safe when we went to the beach today. <laughs> oh, sarap naman. Tami tao? Uh, Opo, okay, pero they are practicing social distancing, so... That's good. We're good. And then we hiked a little bit too before we went. Wow. Uh, thank you, Lord. Yeah. Thank you for the three-day weekend. Oo nga, no? Baka wala nang ano, pagbuti. Apo. <laughs> okay, sigura. Let's pray. Um, mapapansin nyo, if you will notice dun sa ano natin, sa ating chat group, sa group chat, uh, we will pray for the world, syempre. We will pray for the pandemic, Yung economy, kasi medyo ito yung crucial ngayon, kaya napipilitan lahat magbukas eh. Because of the economic reason. Tapos, uh, syempre, we will pray for uh, world peace na wala mo nang magka-iringan, magka-iringan na bansa dahil sa COVID. And uh, we will pray for, what else, uh, the government, our leaders, at syempre, yung role natin for the gospel to be preached. So, sino ang gusto mag-volunteer to pray for the world? Any volunteer? Or mag a na lang ako? Siguro, i-bigay na natin kay, ano, kay Sister Hansel yung uh, praying for the world. Pandemic, economy, world peace, wisdom for leaders, gospel to be preached. And then, this a church, uh, pag-pray naman natin, Yung reopening, crucial yan eh. Pag-pray natin yung online service. Pag-pray natin yung mga Bible study na nangyayari ngayon sa Zoom. Pag-pray natin mga members natin, mga leaders, mga workers, pastors, anong direction, bigyan ng wisdom, maging salt and light lahat. Pag-pray natin yung church na natin sa LA, yung church nila Joan sa Faith, Hope, and Love Assembly. And... Uh, Sino ang gusto mag-pray sa church? Anybody? Any... Uh, any... What do you call this? Any... Uh, Ako na sa church, Pastor. Church po. Ayan, Sister Fe Maranan sa church. Okay. Sa family and friends, uh, of course, yung salvation. Tapos... Uh, 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 dito na yan. dito ko na isusulat yung mga special request nyo. Siguro ako na yung mag-pray uh, nun. Tapos, uh, uh, isulat nyo na lang or sabihin nyo sa akin kung ano yung gusto nyo ipag-pray pa. So, yung bawa, for healing, uh, we're going to, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm going to pray for uh, Edward, meron siyang COVID. Uh, who yeah. else? Gusto niyo pag-pray? Si, uh, Pastor, si, ano, si Stop Madel ba yun? Yung, ano niyo? Oh. Oo, oh, Madel. Madel, uh, Serafin, si Serafin. Jimenez. Oh, Madel Jimenez, ang relative namin. 
ano po yung ano niya ulit yung yung, yung uh, sa cancer po no yes uh, cancer cancer siya breast breast cancer yeah uh, sino pray pa, for healing sino pa ang ipagpe-pray natin for healing ayun pa lang ano ni Christina pinagpe-pray natin yung uncle niya na may cancer din He's feeling better daw. Ano po pangalan? Wow. Christine, uncle. Hindi niya sinabi. Christine's uncle. Mm -hmm. Ano pong ano niya ulit? Uh, cancer din sa lungs. Lungs. Lung cancer. Okay, lung cancer. Puro cancer yung mga tao. Yeah. Ang kapatid ko pala, may blockage sa heart. So we're praying na sana ma... Kasi nire-recommend siya mag-bypass. Sabi niya, no. She's very young. Pinagpipray namin na sana ma magkaroon ng wisdom. Ano pong pala? Grace. Grace for his awa. Ayan, so... Uh, you may asawa, Japanese? Oo. Oh. Hmm. Okay, John. Nakita ko, no? Pa, uh, si Melanie Marquez. Healing from cancer. Okay. okay. Mm. O parang artista ang... Pangalan. May Melanie Marquez, artista. Parang artista. Kapangalan lang. Kapangalan lang. lang. Yeah, kapangalan lang. So, <laughs> ino pa? Sino pa ang gusto natin pag-pray? Uh, yeah, yeah. Si Arian, pag-pray natin. Uh, ano ba yung problem ni Arian? Gusto mo yung ano kami ilang. Ayaw mo pala. Ayaw mo pala. Brother Danny for his uh, kidney. Sige, ako na bahala mag-pray lahat dito sa mga special request. Uh, so, si Sister Hansel sa sa world. Si Sister... Dali uh, lang, wala pa siya. Apo, apo. Si Sister... May kinang kuha pa siya doon. Ikaw daw ang pray sa world. Oh, okay, okay na. Makita yung Ito ano. siya. <laughs> Inano ko na eh. Apo, yung sa world code, yung pandemic, yung economy, yung world peace, uh, wisdom for world leaders, mga presidents, tapos yung gospel to be preached. Apo, sa church, uh, Sister Fe, yung reopening, yung online service, Bible study, mga members, leaders, workers, pastors, anong direction ng church, wisdom, maging salt and light. So lahat ng mga Christian churches uh, magamit ng Diyos. Tapos ako yung magpipray ng mga special requests. And, uh, okay, so ano pa pong uh, special request na prayer? Evening or... Mga frontliners natin, Pastor. Okay, frontliners, let's pray for them. Frontliners of uh, Kaylee first. Yeah. Okay, special request of uh, any prayer request? It's uh, 7.33. So we're we're on time. Sina ano sina Paul? May bago silang outreach na inopen just this week lang. By yeah. study outreach. Actually, Church so, Sunday. Pray for, pray for them. Yeah. Wi they open a new one this week. Wife, a new Bible study group? A new Bible study group. Every Wednesday, ano ba yun? Sunday morning? Every Thursday. Thursday sila nag-open. Kahapon. Iba rin. Fire din yung mga yun. Pagka... On fire yung mga yun. Pagka... <laughs> Pagka uh, ano nag uh, te testimony par parang mahihiya ka na wala kang sasabihin. <laughs> parang, parang ano parang ko question niyo parang bigla mong ko question niyo yung pagka-Kristiyano mo. Parang, parang ano parang uh, ganoon na ba ako hindi ka on fire ngayon o sobrang on fire lang nila. <laughs> Kailangan lang talaga revival sa heart ng tao yung yeah. ma, ma push ba? At saka Ay, yung parang, ito, yung kanilang ano ano yung na reach out eh ano eh uh, tag mga ano yun mga between incarceration yeah. and from the prison to oh. society 
yun ang mid kailangan very critical daw yun dahil kasi hindi mo alam kung anong future na mga yon after yeah. after getting out of prison dami struggles nila eh. halfway Lari, house halfway house tawag <coughs> bili ba ko sa inyo pastor eh Miro nyo, ikaw pinapastag mo sila, ang lalaki ng katawan eh. No? <laughs> <laughs> Tapos ang dadaming tattoo eh. No? Sabi. Ano, eh. <laughs> ang lalaki ng mga tao, ang lilit namin dalawa. <laughs> so, sabi ko nga, parang, ano, parang ma- ma-intimidate ka pag hindi mo pa sila na naririnig ng salita. <laughs> Dapat ikaw din nandun eh kasi malaki ka rin. <laughs> Oo nga. Actually, na-intimidate nga ako eh. Kung hindi ko pa sila naririnig ng salita, yung makikita mo pa lang sila. Hmm? ma-intimidate ka eh. Pero pagka nagsalita na sila, masasabi mo, aba, safe pala ako dito. Lahat pala to. Ano? Iyakin. <laughs> Lahat, iyakin pala kay Lord. Iyakin. <laughs> iyakin yung mga yun. Ay, no. Talagang ano sila eh. No? Ay, nako. Uh, on fire, on fire. To the Lord. Ay, bless. Yeah. Ano lang, ah, uh, nilalandas lang namin kasi minsan mga nag-off, off, yung mga doktrine, walang doktrine eh. Yeah, yun ang tendency. Pag walang doctrine, syempre, kung ano-ano na yeah. yung sabihin, hindi, kailangan ilagay mo siya sa sentro. Yeah, yun ang malaking ano dun eh. Malaking goal niya eh. So, yung, uh, yung training ng pastor. Yung bagay. So, let's pray. Are you okay. ready guys? Uh-huh. So, let's start with uh, uh, Sister Hansel and then uh, praying for the world, praying for the church, Sister Fe. Uh, tapos I will pray for the for the request. If there's anything uh, you would like to add, uh, uh, Sister Joan, Brother JP, or Sister Lenlen, just feel free na just uh, uh, mag free flow lang kayo if you wanna pray also. Uh, kung wala, okay lang din naman. And then uh, Pastor Manny will end us and uh, commit our prayers into the Lord and uh, give us the word. We're done. We're done for the week. All right, game na ba kayo? Let's pray. I'd like to sing the song. I will come and bow down at your feet, Lord Jesus. In your presence, there is fullness of joy. There is nothing, there is no one who compares with you. I take pleasure in worshiping you, Lord. Lord God, we thank you so much that we could honor you and worship your holy name. Thank you, God, that you're a big and awesome God and majestic in power. Mighty and honorable, oh God. We thank you that you are a God who is holy and powerful. You are a God who is mighty. You are a God who covers all the earth. You are a God who sits in the throne. You are a God who gave salvation to all of us. You are a God whose presence abides with us. You are the God who is our rear guard. You are a God who is ahead of us. Who is sending yours, Lord God, commanding your angels in camp around us? You are the God, who God is awesome and majestic. The kings, Lord God, is under your authority. Lord God, I pray for rulers and kings and those who are in authority. You honor kings who honor you, O God. You lift the nation in righteousness for those kings who uphold righteousness. But Lord, this king, who introduces sin into this nation. Lord God, you abhor them. Father, we thank you that we praise you that our nation will be dedicated back to you. Yes, the United please. States of America will come back to you, O oh God. Yes, Even please. Lord God of Philippines, O oh God, let them come back to you, not a religiosity, Lord God, mm-hmm. but having personal relationship with you. Mm-hmm. I'm praying for President Trump, O oh God, that you would give him wisdom mm-hmm. and protection even for all this of, uh, Lord God, persecutions that he's hearing every day, mm-hmm. attacks and malicious um, talks, oh God, in Jesus' name. Yes, Lord God, yes. we bind the spirit that hovers in America in the name of Jesus. Whatever prince of the air and, and the power, Lord God, we rebuke them in Jesus' name. 
because mm -hmm. this nation is dedicated back to you, God, because this nation will bow down to you, God. And in the name of Jesus Christ, we lift the name of Jesus high. Lord, let the American people realize, oh God, the very foundation of this nation, that the very foundation, the forefathers implanted Christianity into this nation. Let us not, Lord God, be swayed by the false teachings of the world. Let us not be swayed, Lord God, by the, the doctrine of humans. In the name of Jesus, Lord God, let the truth prevail into the church in the name of jesus christ so father we pray for the leaders of the nation lord god even those who are atheists even those who are communists even those who are muslim even those who are buddhist even those who are shinto father in the name of jesus and even all sorts of religion lord god this leader will bow down to you in the name of jesus christ lord god some leaders already introduced one world government but Lord, in the name of Jesus Christ, let not this generation be ever be under this one world government. But in the name of Jesus Christ, this nation, the World Health Organization, Lord God, Lord God, trample whatever spirit there is in the name of Jesus Christ. Lord God, that manipulates data in the name of Jesus Christ. Lord, let truth prevail in Jesus Christ to be Lord of every nation from north to south east to west north pole south pole lord god lord god in the name of jesus christ we thank you that your spirit covers all the earth you are the lord of this world you are the lord of this nation oh god you said in your word for god so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son that whoever believes in him should not perish but have everlasting life lord this pandemic is a lesson for all of us let the nation see that this is your hand, oh God, allowing this pandemic to prevail, oh God, so that you're trying to call the attention of people, the leadership of this nation. Lord God, let them not be corrupt. Lord God, I pray that this pandemic will soon be over, oh God, in the name of Jesus. But because the prayer of your people is answered, not because of any scientific things that's happening but lord because you are a god who answers the prayer of your people so lord we are praying that the lesson would be in the hearts of people in the hearts of your believers oh god that lord this pandemic gives us an authority to be sheltered by your hand to be sheltered in the in the shadow of your wings to be sheltered in the presence of the most almighty god so father we thank you that even now in this quarantine, Father, we thank you that you are still the God who prevails and provides for all your people. Father, we pray now for the crisis that would give that would give a fruitful and productive manifestation of your greatness into the hearts of people. So, Father, I'm praying that whatever there is and whatever things that we're praying oh father we're praying for those who are in authority as you said in your word pray for those who are in authority for kings and all the leaders of the nation oh father so we pray for them wherever they are where whatever they're sitting oh god whatever motives in their heart oh god prostrate whatever evil there is in their heart but lord let your presence prevail so, Father, we thank you for your sovereignty to reign supreme into the hearts of these leaders. So there will be change of heart, there will be change of mind, oh God, change of perspective. Oh God, that just in a split of a second, you can just take everything away. You can take away jobs, you can take away economy, you can take away the, the pride of people. In just a split of a second, you can take away life. You can take away future, mm -hmm. but because you are a great and mighty God. So thank you, God. But because of the consequences of our sin, the world is suffering. We're giving birth to pain. But Lord God, we are pleading and interceding in behalf of this land. Mm -hmm. We stand in the gap of this land. Lord, we stand in the gap for the salvation of every person in the world in the name of Jesus. Because you said, for God so loved the world 
that he gave, you gave your one and only son to die. Let Jesus Christ, Lord God, reign to the hearts of people. Let Jesus Christ, oh God, be preached into the streets, into the hearts of people. In the name of Jesus Christ, we thank you, God. We thank you that this pandemic will bring forth fruit of salvation into the hearts of people. Lord God, trust and obedience into your direct will. And we thank you, God. And we thank you that you are going to answer our prayer in Jesus' name. Amen. Sister, Fer, kindly unmute your... Kindly unmute your... There you go. Thank you. Okay, na pa, sir? Okay, na pa. Go ahead. Yes. Thank you, Lord. We praise you, Lord. We glorify your name, O Lord. We give you thanks and glory, O Lord. I leave, we live up to you, Lord, right now. Our church, all the churches of the Nazarene, Lord, as yeah. we are beginning to reopen our services, our yeah. Bible studies, our church gatherings, O Lord. We pray, Lord, that you will prepare the hearts of all the members, O Lord, of all the yeah. leaders, all the pastors, O Lord, as we are beginning to open our churches, O Lord. We pray, O Lord, for all our members uh, that they will be able to join us, O Lord, during our online services, the Bible yeah. studies, the service, our prayers, uh, Saturday prayers, O Lord. We yeah. pray, Lord, that they will set aside important time, O Lord, to, to join us, O Lord, because uh, it is important, O Lord, that we should gather every night, O Lord, to give you praise, to give you worship, O Lord. We pray for all the leaders of our church, O oh Lord. We pray for all our Bible studies, our online services, Lord, that our members, O oh Lord, will, will uh, know that these are important for our spiritual growth, O oh Lord. As you said in your word in Hebrews 10.25, that we should not be uh, meeting mm -hmm. together mm -hmm. because by this we are being encouraged and uh, mm -hmm. we are being used to encourage each and every one of us to be more closer to you, O oh Lord, to know the importance of how it is to know you, O oh Lord, to serve you and share your word, O oh Lord. We live up to you, Lord. All our leaders, all the pastors of the church, we know you should, uh, Lord, we also live up to you, all the members, for them to know that all our pastors are spending time, finding their efforts to prepare for the service, for the word, for the message, so this should be given importance and uh, for our, for our members to know that they, they are not doing this for their own good, but for our own good, O oh Lord, so that we'll be able to be more closer to you, O oh Lord. We thank you, O oh Lord, we praise you, and we continue to live up to you. Our online Bible studies, all our members, all our leaders, our workers, our churches, O oh Lord, all the churches of the Nazarene and other churches in the world, O oh Lord. Thank you, Lord, for all our leaders, for all our pastors, for the effort they are giving to give us, to share to us all the word, and to encourage us, oh Lord. Thank you, Lord, and we praise you. We glorify your name. In Jesus' name, amen. 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 Panginoong Ama sa Langit, nakila ka sa buhay namin. Maraming kaman. Salamat po, Panginoon, dahil kayo ang aming Ama. Maraming salamat po kayo ang aming provider. Uh, Nililift up po namin ang pangalan niyo, Panginoon. Binibless po namin ang inyong puso sa ngayong gabi. Panginoon, kung meron po kaming kasalanan na gawa, naisip o nasabi, Panginoon, dinadalangin namin na pagkalinisan niyo po kami, humingi po kami ng kapatawaran. At dinadalangin namin na kami po ay inyong patawarin, kami po ay inyong turuan kung anong ang tama at nararapat. Paano po kami mamuhay na naayon, Panginoon, sa inyong kaluwalhatian, Panginoon. Maraming 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 salamat po na uh, in spite po sa nangyayari ngayon ay patuloy po yung pagpapala niyo sa amin, patuloy yung protection niyo sa amin, patuloy yung pag-aalaga niyo sa church namin. Ganun din po sa church nila, Sister Joanne and Brother JT, ang faith, hope, and love. Uh, dalangin na yung Panginoon na kanilang mga pastor, mga leaders sila, Panginoon, na patuloy niyo pong gamitin sa mga oras sa pagkakataon na ito, Panginoon. Dinadalangin namin sa inyo, Panginoon, ang aming mga pamilya at mga kaibigan na hindi pa nakakakilala sa inyo. Kami Amen. Sa pagkakataon na ito, Lord, na makakilala sila sa inyo. Kami din yes. Na kayo po ang magbigay, Panginoon, ng... Uh, na magpahay, ipahayag niyo yung sarili niyo sa mga sa mga, uh, mga bagay na napapanood nila sa internet, mga sermon, service, Bible study. Lahat po ng ito ay magamit niyo, Panginoon, upang mayatid ang inyong gospel, Lord God. Dalangin namin, Panginoon, ang kanilang salvation. Dalangin namin, Panginoon, ang kanilang 
uh, uh, pagkakilala sa inyo, Panginoon, ang paglagunin na sa inyo, Panginoon. Nalangin na yung Panginoon si Brother Edward, Panginoon, na nasa UAE. Uh, meron po siyang COVID. Dalangin namin na kayo po mag, mag ano po sa kanya. Kayo po magaling. Kayo po ang uh, bigay Panginoon ng, uh, ng uh, kalakasan sa dinadaanan niya ngayon, Panginoon. Dalangin namin, Panginoon, ang, um, ang gobyerno namin dito sa Amerika at ang gobyerno namin sa Pilipinas. Kayo po ang humawak. Kayo po ang mag... Uh, bigay ng direksyon Panginoon uh, ay yung ayan yung mayroong kapayapaan sa puso ng lahat ng tao na hindi mangamba at matutupong umasa sa inyo dalangin namin Panginoon na uh, si si Brother Danny Panginoon na uh, makakuha po siya ng kidney donor Unang-una po, palakasin niyo po yung katawan niya para ma-prepare po ba Panginoon siya sa transplant. Uh, gawin niyo pong available yung kidney na ilalagay sa kanya, Panginoon. Kayo po mag-provide sa pamilya niya. Bigyan niyo po siya ng uh, katahimikan sa puso at uh, 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 yung, faith, yung faith niya po ay lumakas sa pinagdadaanan niya ngayon, Panginoon. Dalangin namin si Sister Madel Jimenez, Lord God. Uh, meron po siyang breast cancer, Lord God. Naniniwala kami na hindi po may kliyang kamay niyo. Kayo niyo po siyang kawakan ngayon. Abang kami na nanalangin, paramdam sa kanya, yes. mahal niya siya. Ayon niya po siyang extend ng kamay niya sa kanya ngayon at pagalingin siya. Okay. Ngayon din, Panginoon, dahil wala po sa inyo ang cancer, wala po sa inyo ang stage 4, wala po sa inyo yes. ang mga pagay na pwede makasira sa tao. Kung nanaisin niyo, Lord, uh, pwede niyong gawin, Panginoon. At ito po ay uh, bilang pamilya, isang simbahan, kami po ay nananalangin na kayo po ay kumilos at ipakita, magpakita ng milagro. Na tumawag po siya sa amin at sabihin na siya ay gumaling, Panginoon, sa pamagitan ng aming panalangin na wala po kaming kapangyarihan pero meron po kayo, Panginoon. At uh, kayo po ay aming uh, inaanihan, Panginoon, na ipakita ang kapangyarihan niya sa tao na to para po mahalin niya kayo, mas ma makilala niya kayo at i-reveal niyo ang sarili niya sa kanya, Panginoon. Dalangin namin, Panginoon, si uh, Melanie Marquez, Lord God, na meron din po siyang cancer. Dalangin namin, Panginoon, na uh, na kayo rin po ang humipo sa kanya, Panginoon. Dalangin na yung Panginoon na na-comfort niya yung pamilya, pamilya niya, i-comfort niya si Melanie, Lord God, sa mga pinagdadaanan niya ngayon. Dalangin namin na, na palakasin niyo po ang loob niya. At uh, higit sa lahat, Lord God, by the blood of Jesus, we declare complete healing for Melanie, Lord God. In Jesus' name, we declare that she is healed right Amen. now, Lord God. Yes, Lord, in Jesus' name. For Christine's uncle, Lord in God, Jesus is suffering from lung cancer, Lord God. Lord, you're the only powerful being who can yeah. prepare a lung cancer, yeah. Lord. Yeah. We, we just want to declare and we just, we just want to challenge, Lord God, uh, you, to, to show your greatness, Lord God, by healing these people, Lord God, that mm. we're mentioning. Uh, yung lung cancer, Lord God, ni, mm. yung, yung, uncle ni, uh, yung uncle ni Christine, Panginoon, dalangin namin na mm. pagkalingin niyo po siya ngayon, Lord God. Dalangin mm. namin na ipakita niyo yung imposible sa mata ng tao pero posible sa kapangyarihan niyo. Pag yes. Dalangin namin, Panginoon, si Grace na meron pong uh, heart problem. Dalangin namin, mm. Panginoon, na, na kayo po ang mag-repair ng kanyang puso. Kayo po, yes. Panginoon, na mag-provide ng mga pangailangan niya. Mm. Kayo po, Panginoon, yes. na magpalusog ng kanyang katawan, Panginoon. Kayo po, Panginoon, na magbigay ng kalakalan ng kanyang loob, kalakasan ng kanyang yes. isip. At uh, uh, higit sa lahat, Panginoon, dinidiklet na magaling na, Panginoon, si Grace ngayon sa kanyang uh, heart problem. Yes. Dalangin na, Panginoon, na, na kay rin po ang uh, mag, uh, mag, mag-prepare, mag Panginoon, kay Arian, kay rin po ang mag, uh, uh, mag, mag, mag uh, bahala sa chemotherapy process niya, Lord God. Uh, we pray that it will be successful. We pray, Lord God, that you will give wisdom to the doctors. And we pray also for complete healing for Sister Aryan, Lord God. Yes. Uh, yes. She will uh, uh, come out uh, 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 victorious in this, uh, in this uh, uh, challenge, Lord God, <coughs> sa buhay niya, Panginoon. Panginoon, inaangat namin sa inyo lahat ng frontliners namin mga nurses, mga LVNs, mga caregivers, mm. mga medtech, mga uh, delivery personnel, mga construction mm. personnel na, na nasa church namin sa LA First of the Nazarene, ganun din, mm. na yung mga frontliners na Faith, Hope, and Love Assembly, Panginoon. Uh, kayo po ang mag-protect po sa kanila sa araw-araw nagpagpasok nila sa trabaho. Kayo po, mm. Panginoon, ang uh, magbigay ng... Uh, ng patuloy na, na na security, Panginoon, na hindi po sila mahawa sa pantapit. Yes, yes, Lord. Yes. Yes, Lord. Yes. Yes. Panginoon, ang, 
ang paglawak ng iyong ministry sa Waipa, Panginoon, sa Walk in Faith uh, yes. uh, Church of the Nazarene, Lord God, na ginagamit nyo ang mga mga tao na to Panginoon, na nasa, na they used to be na nasa kadiliman, pero ngayon, dinala nyo sa liwanag, hmm. uh, patuloy nyo ginagamit para ma, ma maging uh, ilaw at <coughs> Amen. 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 Ah, na katulad na pinagdaanan niya yeah. Panginoon from incarceration Panginoon papunta yeah. Panginoon sa kumbaga from prison to to palace Panginoon. At uh, yeah. ito ang uh, hari ng palasyo na yan at uh, maraming salamat sa binuon yung Bible study group every Wednesday para sa mga yeah. uh, mga mga kapatid namin Panginoon na local dito na kayo yeah. rin po ang uh, magbibigay ng direction sa kanila, magtuturo sa kanila, magbibigay ng wisdom. Panginoon sa buhay nila. Maraming salamat Panginoon sa kapangyarihan ng panalangin. Maraming salamat sa tuwing uh, magkikita kami, nagkakamusta kami, nagkaka, nagkakaroon kami ng pagkakataon na uh, to check on each other. At maraming Amen. salamat Panginoon na, na, na pero pagkakataon na iangat ang inyong pangalan Panginoon sa sa, sa, sa uh-huh. magkakasama-sama. Uh, ito po ang aming dalangin. Maraming maraming salamat po sa ngalan po ng Panginoong Yesus. Amen. Amen. Lord, we agree with all of those prayers and we believe that you have answered all of those prayers Amen. and we thank you, we claim thank all you of Lord. your promises, O oh Lord God, that yes, us and it shall be given unto us. Amen. Seek and will find, knock and it will be open. And so we thank you as you will just heal our land. We thank Amen. you as you will bless our church, O oh Lord God, as we reopen. We, bl- yes. we thank you as you will bless our members, O oh Lord God. Amen. Thank you for those healing, O oh Lord God that you will accomplish upon these people that we have presented before you. Mm-hmm. We thank you because, Lord, you will bless us, O Lord, even protect all the frontliners. And so we commit all these prayer requests unto you, and we Amen. pray that yes, you will Lord. just, Lord, uh, yes. take control of thank everything Lord, that will Amen. happen Amen. Amen. in the coming weeks ahead mm-hmm. as we seek your will for us, as mm-hmm. the churches will be reopened, Lord. Mm. We would like to pray a prayer of blessing for every family represented here, mm. for the family of Pastor Jeff. Mm-hmm. And uh, we pray for him. We pray that you'll bless them, protect them always from this, uh, a COVID virus. Mm. We pray also Amen. for the yes, Lord. Sister Fe, oh Lord, mm-hmm. Fe Maranan. We pray a prayer of blessing upon them and the entire Amen. members. Thank you, Lord. Even for the family of Len Len, oh Lord, mm. we pray for her. And you will protect them from COVID. And also for the Galleon family, mm-hmm. blessing and good health upon them. Mm-hmm. Even for our family, oh Lord, that you will just bless us as we are your, your prayer warriors. And by the blood of the Lamb, oh Lord, mm-hmm. you will take control and you will just uh, heal us, oh Lord God. And, and so we pray, Lord, for strength for each day, wisdom, guidance, direction and provision for each and every one of us, O oh Lord. Mm-hmm. The Lord bless you and keep mm-hmm. you. The Lord make his face mm-hmm. to shine upon you mm-hmm. and be gracious yes. unto you. The Lord lift up his countenance upon you and give you peace in the name of God the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit, I pray. Amen. Amen. Thank you, guys. Remember, Thank next, you. next Saturday, uh, it's 7 o'clock morning not evening <laughs> so it's a zoom prayer ah. breakfast <laughs> so ready your breakfast <laughs> and uh, please be encouraged uh, uh, we don't care if there's only two or three who will come I have to go Saturday I have to go yeah, uh, as long as uh, there are people who are standing in the gap and praying for okay. our church, for our for everything in this world, uh, please be encouraged to uh, just uh, let's keep on going and uh, continue our prayer ministry. So we'll see you again uh, tomorrow <laughs> and uh, we'll see you again next uh, Saturday. Thank you guys. God bless okay. you. Bye, yeah, bye. Bye. bye, Len Len. Bye, Sister Fe. Bye. Bye, Pastor. Bye, Pastor. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Uh, it's 8 o'clock. Sakto lang. <laughs> bye. <laughs>